guys so long time no film i am back home back from vacation i took a week of vacation um not from youtube like i actually went somewhere and i am back to just share with you i want to share with you actually what i bought on vacation like we just got home a couple hours ago and i want to share with you what i bought um i have a makeup haul so you're gonna see this no makeup face with this huge where's my bump oh my god it was so big um so, you're going to see this with the next couple videos or just as I mix them in with my other routinely videos. But vacation was great. Yeah. Um, so, I wanted to show you we went shopping a little bit. The vacation purpose wasn't shopping, but things came about. The actual first thing is I didn't buy it on vacation, but it was delivered the day I left for vacation. So, I couldn't use it until now. Um, my, I have new lighting. I don't know if you can tell it's brighter or not. Um, I ordered two softbox lights. I posted a picture on Instagram. I ordered two of the softbox um, lights from Amazon. It was a set. I got a really great deal on them. And so, I'm under those three lights now. So, I have those two on and my ring light. I have my main room light on too. Um, but yeah, I'll show you the difference in the lighting so you can kind of see. So this is no light, just the natural light coming from the window. This is my ring light. And this is my ring light plus the two soft boxes. Alright, so we're going to begin the haul. Um, just we went, um, I went to uh, Massanutten. It's a resort in Virginia. Uh, me and Nelson have been there before. And this time it was me and Nelson and my mom who went. Um, even though that sounds weird, but it, we had fun. So, um, that stuff I forgot to put away. Alright, so we went to the bookstore. We went to, where did I get these from? I went to two different bookstores. Barnes and Nobles. So Barnes and Nobles had a huge table of, um, books for five bucks. Like, really pretty thick hardback books. So I picked up 101 Chilling Tales Great Horror Stories. I like I like reading short stories. I like reading novels too, but I like reading short stories. Um, so I picked this up and it's just various, various authors. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna get to it. I like the short stories because I can read it like one or two in a day. I don't have to like, you know, draw it out like you, you when you're reading a novel because my classes have started so I don't have as much free time, but I can read one a night. That'd be kind of cool. Um, and then I got a treasury of classic mystery stories. They had a lot of these type of books. Um, again, various authors. They had thriller, supernatural, all types of stuff. All types of stuff. Okay? So I got those two books. And then, where's my other? Come on. So we went to another bookstore. I didn't get any books from that bookstore. So I don't know if you guys know. You should know. I'm an avid Harry Potter fan. Although, um, that's my like, I don't want to say like in that order. Like I can't, I can't choose between. But I'm an avid Harry Potter fan. But I don't know if you guys know I'm also an avid Nickelodeon Nicktoons fan. Like 90s Nick. You guys know I have the Nick box. I'm, I'm, I'm very, I love it. I really do. Um. And so, I have, like, seasons, all the seasons, like, Hey Arnold, different things on DVD. Like, I just love it. Just, I don't know. They make me happy. Um, with that being said, I am in the process of collecting all the Harry Potter pops. Um, I've had, I've had them, like, been collecting for years or whatever here and there. Not, like, on it, like, every time I see when I buy it, but, like, I have extra money and, like, okay, I'm adding it. Oh, hopefully I'll get them all. You know what I'm saying? So, anyway, with that being said, I went to... Uh, and I take my pops out of the box. I know my best friend's like, you take them out of the box. I never plan on selling them. I'm not big on like keeping things in mint condition. And uh, no, they're for me. Maybe I'll pass them down one day. But ooh, change and receipts. But it ain't that. It ain't that serious. Okay, so um, yeah, these two. The box is all bent. They got bent in the car. So I found McGonagall. If you're Harry Potter fans, you know what I'm talking about. I found McGonagall. This was at Books A Million, and it was 50% off. These were $5. Come on. They had a whole table. These are the only two Harry Potter ones I saw. And Umbridge. We love to hate her. Um, and they were on clearance. So I picked those two up. And then, at Hot Topic, I was in there. Whoa. My mom. I was helping my mom pick out some earrings. And um, this, she bought me these studs because I'm going to just say a certain Ashley piercing might be coming back. That's all I'm going to say. All I'm going to say. All I'm going to say. Uh, but anyway, they had some pops on sale. Three for 
I know in Hot Topic, their pops are a little more expensive. Like, everywhere I've seen pops are around 10 bucks. Hot Topic, they're 12 50 So, it was 3 for 27 which made them 9 bucks a piece. Anyway, I picked up Harry Potter with Hedwig. This is a Hot Topic exclusive. Um, so, I picked him up. There's all these exclusives and all this other type of stuff. It's too much. It's too much. But anyway, I picked that one up. Um... And then the other two I picked up was Tommy. So when I went in, um, where did I go for? I went to Books of, Books of Noble. Books a Million first. And they had Tommy. They also had Tommy and Chucky in a dual pack, but they weren't on sale. Um, so I got Tommy from the Rugrats. He looks kind of creepy. I don't know why his eyes are so huge, but all oh, Pop's eyes are huge. And they didn't have Chucky. They had cat dogs. <laughs> so I picked those up and I have, I'm working on, I'm going to do an updated beauty room tour. Um, I won't say it's soon, soon, um, but it's coming because I'm still, I'm not reorganizing. I've added some more storage. I put some shelves on the wall, some things like that. So I have a shelf for my Nicktoons and Harry Potter Pops. So I'm, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Okay. I'm working on it. Okay. I'm sitting on this bag. Me and my mom went to Old Navy. Um, just because. And so we picked up a couple things. Their dresses were 40% off. I'm not a big dress girl, I'm gonna be honest with you, because I don't sit like a lady and uh, it's too much. But, um, they are comfortable and they're quick and things like that. So I do like dresses and leggings in the fall and boots, but I'm not like, I have to really be in the mood to wear a dress. But anyway, um, this is a plain, just like jersey style. Um, it's long sleeve. It's A-line. So it like flows out, at, flares out the bottom. I'm doing a horrible job of showing you guys this. Yeah. So all their dresses, not just this style, but um, others as well, were 40% off. But anyway, the reason why I showed you this dress, because I got this one, and I got another one like it, but it is, I love stripes, like, and it's A-line and it flares out. And so that's cute. I love stripes with like a pop of color. It's so like red shoes with that. That'd be cute. Alright, and then another dress I picked up was this one. Just made just like this A-line like that, but it's sleeveless. And so this is cute with a jean jacket and some boots and this burgundy color. Yo, that's going to be cute. <laughs> and to go with, the leggings were $10.00. To go with the burgundy dress, or whatever dress, I got these burgundy tribal print leggings, as well as the gray tribal print leggings. Alright, and then I got one pair of jeans. So, you, when Old Navy jeans go on sale, I mean, they tear the rack up. I mean, up. So, I need long. I need long jeans. And I only found one pair of, I wear 16, long jeans. It's long. Couldn't find any other long jeans, but these are just a plain pair of skinny jeans. Um, you can never have enough jeans. Never have enough skinny jeans. I don't own a pair like this. The other pair, I have like three pairs recently that I've purchased from Old Navy um, that I can fit now. <laughs> like I've had them as a kid. And uh, But these are the original mid-rise skinny. Yeah, original skinny. I like the Rockstar super skinny, but these are skinny. Um... And so, the other ones I have have a dark pair, I think I have a black pair, and I have a pair that are ripped. A little bit ripped. They had another pair I wanted. They were gray and they had big rips. 30% <sighs> off the jeans, though. Alright, so this is crazy. Me and my mom went out and we went to Goodwill because I love thrifting. However, we didn't find anything. Um, I didn't find any clothes. I did find a little organizer thing. However, these socks were new in packs, and I thought they were so cute. Look, they're like mesh socks. They were three packs, like mesh socks. Put my hand in it so you can really see. Oh my God, how cute are these socks? So I got um, two packs, two multi-packs. They got black stripes, polka dots. And you guys know I have clear converses, so... That's cute. My mother was like, yeah, clear Converse's. And I was like, yeah. I was like, you got to wear the right shoes with those socks. My mother. I got a lot of coupons, too. Um, so. So, yeah. Okay, last 
place we went, well, it wasn't the last place, but last place I'm going to show you, I think, is icing. Um, <laughs> there are some things that I really like, like as a girl, that I really like, but I hate shopping for. Clothes. I really like clothes. Um, I don't, I don't like putting them on, like the idea of putting clothes on, not wearing clothes. Like I like to be cute, but putting them on, I'm literally lifting my leg to put it in my pants. So like, like I am so lazy. Like I wish I could snap my fingers and my clothes be on. Um, but I like clothes, but I hate clothes shopping. I really do. Um, it's a pain. When I mean, you're plus size, it's depressing. Um, <sighs> purses. I love Purses. I hate shopping for them. I don't know what that is. Just the whole row. They just overwhelm it. It's too much. Uh, <laughs> however, we picked up some purses. Icing's bags. Um, they were like all bags was twenty five dollars. Uh, but they were ringing up like ten dollars and fifteen dollars, and then they were buy three get three free. So between me and my mom, we got six bags. She got two bags. I got four bags. And let me show you. I got the same bag in two different colors. I know I'm doing too much. Uh, the I think it is the Airmans or Birkin. Whichever Birkin um, knockoff thing, I don't mind having a bag that looks like an expensive bag. I mean, it's just the style. It's not like I got like a fake LV <laughs> bag. Um, so I got it in white. I don't want a white purse. And I got it in black because I liked it. And these were 10 and $15. I think the white one was 10 or the white one was 20 The most expensive bag we got was 20 bucks. So I got the black one. And my mom got two bags, and I got this bag. It's like a faux Chanel bag. I didn't even think about it like that. I'm doing too much. Let me show you. It's like a cream. It's not white. It's more cream. That is cute, girl. Cute, 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 cute. Cute going out bag. And then I got this small bag. I don't know why. It's, um... I don't know why I was drawn to it. Look pretty, play dirty. It's a makeup bag. Look pretty, play pr play dirty. Like, I need a makeup bag. But it's, like, the perfect size for a purse. I don't carry a lot of makeup in my purse. Um, I don't. I carry, like, that's in my purse no matter what. Like, I don't, like, carry... I do. I carry the lipstick that I'm currently wearing, like, you know, at the time in the purse. But things that stay in my purse are lip balm, my mirror, my blotterazzi, a lip gloss, um, my Lorac lip gloss, and Secret Agent. It's like my lips are better. Always need it. My perfume and things. And they're kind of loose. They be loose in my purse. I'm like my mirror, my compact. So, I have some. I'm going to put them in now. So, yeah. All that crap over there. So, yeah, that was all the random stuff I picked up. While on vacation, we went to the Dollar Tree um, <laughs> and got some things that we were needing because we stayed in like this condo. It was a huge condo, so we needed like things for our groceries and things like that. So, but yeah, that was the fun stuff I wanted to share with you guys. Stay tuned because I'm about to fill my makeup haul and I didn't want to put it into video. I didn't want to make this video too long. So that was my random stuff. And now I'm going to show you some makeup. So stay tuned. This video, hopefully they'll go up in order. I don't know, but you just know I'm going to do some makeup now. Alright, I love you guys and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.